Hey guys, I'll be doing a quick tutorial on how you can change your PLDT Wi-Fi password and this is especially for those who have their PLDT newly installed and it's the first time you are trying to connect to your Wi-Fi. So immediately after connecting to your Wi-Fi, you want to change your password. So here's how you do it using a Google Chrome. You can either do that in the computer or on your phone. So for me, I'll be doing it in the computer. This is the Google Chrome here open, ready. Just type in the URL 192.168.1.1. And if you happen to get this error, all you need to do is tap on advanced over here. And right down below, it says proceed to 192.168.1.1 and just click on that and there we go so PLDT username default username and password is gonna be admin and password is one two three four okay so it says initial login on this account you must modify account password SSID name and authentication password click OK so we are in this page where it says account management starting with the web page. So the web page username admin and the old password which is 1234 and create a new password. So let's go about 9876543321. So confirm that 9876543321. Another um, option here we have the 2.4G SSID1. So you might either want to use anything, any name, any SSID name. So let's say SSID is see dragon. Okay. So dragon. So password I want to put in okay my birthday. So let's say birth sorry. Password. Okay. And confirm the password birthday 29 and SSID name for the 5G SSID so I'll choose balls so dragon balls and I put in a password maybe birthday 11 22 birthday 11 22 and click apply so just remember the uh, password for the 2.4G and the 5G so it's usually different okay click that apply and access successful all you gotta do is click back now to log in back to the admin page is using the admin username and the password is 986 sorry 7654321 okay got it got it so oh sorry about that let me refresh so here we go again with admin 9876543321. Click login. And boom, here we go. We've just logged in. So we have the password and the SSID 2.4G and 5G. We're gonna locate that over here. Security. So here we go with the basic and click advanced. And there we have the dragon SSID and the security password birthday 29 and then next to that is the 5g advanced now it says balls and the password that's the password over there i'm gonna change that later also well for now so that's how you do it that's how you change your password i got an additional tutorial here for you how you can enable the LAN ports of the pldt wi-fi as previously showed in one of my videos so what I'm trying to access right now is how you can enable the debug switch. So all the information is right over the description of my video. So check out guys the video right there. So we're able to successfully log into the debug switch so we can enable them. As you can see guys, all the username and passwords are just here in my video over here how to enable LAN ports of PLT Wi-Fi. So this is a bonus tutorial also. 
So let me go now to the debug switch over here. Just enable that, enable. Okay, this one. Um, I want to enable that also. Apply, click apply, apply, apply. All good. And log out. Okay, and using the same URL with that 192.168.1.1 forward slash FH. So click enter again. Now going back to my video over here. Let's get the username and password for the username. Sorry, for the administrator of the super admin access. Okay, this is the password. And now initial login on this account. You must modify account password. So let's do modification on a password. So old password is gonna be the password that we've just copied. This is one this is the one here. So I'll just paste that. And for the password over here, I might put XXXX XXXX. Let me see how many X's eight. So XXXX XXXX. So that one, new password. Access successful and just click the back admin pldt so x x x x x x x x login now we're in here so just go to network over here then go to broadband settings and then you will have that internet settings over here click the internet settings and enable or disable the LAN ports. So you have that LAN 1, LAN 2, LAN 3 binding. And when all that is enabled, just click apply. Okay, for this, if I check this, I don't know what's going to happen, but let me check them also to make sure. And click apply. And boom, so all of them are checked now, so I can just log out. Okay, so as you can see guys, LAN binding, LAN 1, LAN 2, LAN 3, LAN 4 are all enabled. It says here IPTV, let me check that, oh okay. It's asking for the VLAN, I don't know what that is. Remote management, so this is how a super admin basically looks like, if you have access to this. Super admin. And enable the LAN ports of your PLDT Wi-Fi. Just go watch my video how to enable the LAN ports of PLDT Wi-Fi. Article 895. And thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, hit the like button below. And if you have not subscribed yet, subscribe for more videos. With that being said, peace out.